All right, we're doing another Frost Knight run. This was kind of a heavily requested challenge, so to speak, when it was kind of a holiday themed run. This is not gonna be a strict run. The idea is that three out of four of us are going to be running a holiday hero in their commander slot. I'm not going to be doing that because I want to use a pop shot and there are no good holiday shotgun heroes. But we got Ty Baby running Ice King, who is fantastic in general. He's actually the most popular constructor in the game. Super, super good for freezing enemies in place. Then we've got Kieran, I believe is running Crack Shot. Super standard Crack shot build he's gonna be pairing that with the uh blizzard blitzer or the pain train i'm not certain which one yet kind of his choice there and then we've got another zenith user i know zenith is one of the most popular frost knight heroes but for a good reason and then we got breezy running zenith basically the exact same build he's ran in a couple of our no crafting runs it's just really really good he's gonna be pairing that with the boom bow which is super satisfying because it's a very fitting weapon so like i said blizzard blitzer really good weapon uh let me just do research no if i do select item i can show my copies here yeah so down here in the description section i can show you there are a lot of good six perks for this weapon if you snare them that's really useful if you hit them seven times freezing them is really useful i believe that affects um i believe that affects uh, hit, hit hit monsters hit missed monsters oh my goodness so then we got the other bonus where you can do 44 percent damage versus fire enemies so it's a really really good weapon with a lot of diversity and then the pain train just is super strong there are some excellent perk options with this weapon it actually has a pretty decent mag size with a mag size perk so taking advantage of crack shot is no big deal there and finally what i'm going to be doing actually i should i should mention real quick ty's probably going to be running senna's little helper shark attack heavy explosives because she's a constructor she can just run demo penny super easily to do tons of damage i am going to be doing <laughs> peace just speak bro i'm trying i'm trying stream chat's giving me they're, they're heckling me right now so link in description down below to the twitch chat if you guys want to join these streams live i'm gonna be running the pop shot that's why i'm saying this is a holiday themed run it's not necessarily a challenge run it's just themed and i really want to use this weapon because it is one of the best shotguns in the game i believe if you factor in best perks damage per second accounting for reload it's the highest dps shotgun in the game i don't strictly speaking think it's the best shotgun in the game although the top three ground ponder house buster pop shot are interchangeable functionally this is a very very strong weapon so much so that i supercharged a single copy long ago very very good weapon and yes these are optimal perks it seems a little silly to do mag size and reload but with this weapon you are reloading super fast i believe it's 7.5 shells per second you are reloading faster than you can shoot and you're doing excellent damage on top of that which is why i ran a construct or why i ran a buckshot raptor uh soldier lead he's not a holiday hero but it's a holiday weapon so i think it's good enough uh Buckshot Raptor plus Toy Rocking Out, critting tons of time, Subwafers just to activate the team perk whenever I want. These are just basic damage perks if you guys re want to replicate this build. I have a shotgun loadout video on my channel that talks through all the different options. The one thing I'm going to mention and clarify is that I'm running Saurian Might because his extra damage is not that much, but once every second he will apply that damage, and when he does, it counts for two kills off of Battle Beats. So you can activate her perk a little bit quicker. It's a little nice, not not too bad, and uh, I'm, I'm not running Coconuts in this build because I'm running Wafers and I don't want Although, it just occurred to me that Ty's going to be running coconuts and dropping it to the team, which means I'm going to be using coconuts anyway, so why don't I just put it in the support, giving myself a 16% damage bonus instead of 15 contingent on a reload, which will be happening regularly. That 50% damage bonus is basically constant because of how much you reload, but 16% is a lot better and the healing is nice as well so yeah coconuts and wafers in the same build it's gonna be a fun time so uh yeah let's hop in game and get it started all right just loading in here you know you i have the... what archer what are you in the wrong overlay yeah <laughs> thanks for paying more attention than me there we go and I took away display capture so it doesn't lag my game as much. Yeah, I haven't ran coconuts in so long in these runs that it's weird. I get to actually get my own coconuts this time. So nice and easy. I always like to search everything nearby. We don't have a dedicated farmer in this run, do we? Nope. I've uh, been... No, I guess Breezy is a outlander. Good enough. You know, that's the thing. I... I have been one of those people that has heavily, heavily, heavily supported the use of... Why are we building out a brick? I didn't mean to. <laughs> you didn't mean to, okay. I, I've, I've supported Clip heavily, and she is amazing. She's just, um, overkill, you know? I was beating Frost Knight for a lot of years before Clip existed. You don't strictly need her, um, and she's not a holiday hero, so it wasn't in theme. Demon Gamer, thank you for the bits, filling up my cup. Got a power cell. You got a power cell already? Holy crap. I don't know who needs that first. You and me are pretty even, so... Yeah, I'll, I'll get my resources later. 
Just recycle all my stuff. It's always the first couple of waves that don't even need anything. Just throw out some drones and kill the enemies by hand. Smack them with your pickaxe if you need to. No big deal. Actually, yeah. Wait, so I just realized. What? We're still not placing traps this time, correct? Uh, traps. Say that again. I'm sorry. It was quiet. Are we not placing our? No, we could. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Normal run. run. Normal run, just with holiday heroes and weapons. That was the idea. Okay. I know we didn't really define Don't that very them clearly. Traps, baby. Yes, place your traps. Round five, ideally, because the first four waves don't really need them. I gotta go pick up my kid. You don't need to do that. You can just hang out with right, us. Donna, <laughs> every actually, time you walk to the bus stop real quick. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's not too bad actually. Every time she's in our call and she's like, "Oh, I gotta go pick up my kid," I'm like, ah, you don't need to. I just try to talk her out of it. <laughs> just leave him. Um, the Isaac Daily was insane today. Finding of Isaac. Yeah, earlier! I asked if that was a reference to a game. Somebody mentioned something about Save Jesus, and that's like a puzzle game that I'm aware of, and I'm like 90% sure that's what he meant. He said yes. Because <laughs> I'm usually um, averse to... What's the term for spreading religion? Whatever that is in my chat, I usually like to leave people to their own devices there, but I recognize the name of that as Save Jesus. My friend gifted it to me because it was like... Wait, what? Oh, the... Dude just exploded, now I have a power cell. Okay, it was a troll. A friend of mine gifted me Save Jesus when it was like 50 cents on Steam or something. And it's actually a fun game. It's like a little puzzle game. This isn't paid advertisement or anything, but if you guys want a silly puzzle game that'll be fun to play while you watch the stream, then uh, go for it. That was cool. Pop on my war cry to mine faster because the cooldown was going to be back before the round started, and it is so convenient. Wait, did you say you were building or did you... Yeah, I'll build. Yeah, yeah. Last run was a little cramped, so let me place the basics and you put traps wherever makes sense. Oh, I got a tiger jaw. Oh, that's not holiday theme though. Hmm. Huh. I got another power so. I, wow, dude. Uh, set everybody up. Oh, I don't have five. What? What is going on? Where have you got five from? I don't know. <laughs> we had a run like that. We had a run like that, where our team came up with like seven power cells in the first round. Sometimes it just happens that way. Oh, that sound effect. You know, not everybody loves the hit marker sounds, but it is really satisfying when a grenade goes off and kills a bunch of things Actually, at once. Okay. It's good. I I believe the term you were looking for earlier was preaching. Preaching? Yes, yes. Uh, let me get these recycled. I should be so close to a Huskbuster. Uh, oh, no, not a Huskbuster. What Pop do shot. I, I don't know what I need. Uh, all the weapons I can craft are hiding the ones I can't. I don't like this crafting system. I need two sunbeam. Two sunbeam. I have all if you want. I heard Ty, and I think she's next to me. Breezy's next to me. Who's standing in front of me? All right, Kieran, you're up. I, I need two sunbeam. sunbeam. I need two sunbeam, Kieran. No, I said let me build the. Okay. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna bust out these walls. Or I'll, I'll do it like this. So I did this in a previous run of mine. And I really liked this layout. Going two tiles out before the walls go up. It was much more open concept, you know? It's just a much better breathing room. It really opened up the space and made it much more inviting. The guests are really going to love it. I don't have any metal, though. Does I have, have... Uh, metal and my supply drops about to be ready. I'll head back to the base here in a second. All right. Oh yeah, we dropped. I got 38 coconuts. 38 coconuts. I don't need your coconuts, uh, but. Oh, breezy, do you want? Yeah, 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 yeah. They'll they'll need the coconuts. Um, yeah, sure, I'll take some. I guess that makes yeah, me a I'm coconut right distributor now. too. Coconuts are funny because it's it's always like so much team help, you know, dropping everybody whatever they need coconuts wise. But typically, you know, 30 or 40 coconuts is. Good for the whole run, for the most part. Um, if you're a coconut user, you should always have a coconut active during the defenses, because that 16% damage is tight, but it's also strictly unnecessary. <sighs> well, the Xenon or Vacuum Dubo, with the Xenon or Vacuum Dubo, Chef's Kiss, what are they talking about? Oh man, I'm lagging again! Every run! 
You know, I'd restart my router if it wouldn't kill the stream. I should just do that someday. It really has been a while, which is ironically a good thing. Like, our internet has been so stable for so long that we haven't had to restart the router in a while. But maybe that would just be good. I don't want to buy a new one. It'd be like $200, and I don't, I don't want to. But I will if I have to. Here I come, Breeze, with your coconuts. I got so he came back without changing his name, and then he said he's not a bot. <laughs> that was like... The least important part of everything I said to that user. They have a username that is redirecting to a website that I don't think it should be redirecting to in my YouTube chat, and I asked them to change their name and they did not. Do I just keep timing them out until they change it? I don't know. I don't know. Just trying to make my YouTube- What? Oh, no, no. Uh, Breeze is coconuts. You said you didn't need any, yes. No, I got 17. Oh, all these no crafting attempts makes me appreciate being able to craft. Okay. Beast, you can have six. Well, I don't need a crafting unit. I don't want any. I'm good. I'm gonna go get some Are these even gonna stack? Okay, good. <laughs> then, okay. Um, I'm gonna drop my metal and brick right here. All right. Let's uh, go out two tiles. Nope, that's already two tiles. All right. Look at me paying attention. There we go. There we go. Throw the drones. Don't need to put builds down yet. Oh, and blue glow. I can do that. There's a crate of blue glow right here. Yep. That's why we let it go under 25% to people watching in the video here. Just to let you know. You have a problem with someone and have your because your chair is well behaved. I find it ironic that you have a problem with someone and have to time them out an hour. After telling you need a new mod because your chat is well behaved. So you're connecting dots that aren't there. Um, my chat is generally well behaved. I think timing out one person myself so far in a two and a half hour. So to bring everybody up to speed, I had a conversation earlier about how I moderate people and that my chat is usually well behaved and that I don't really need that many mods. And I have somebody in Twitch chat saying that's ironic because now I need to time somebody out. But one... Time out by hand on YouTube chat, which is where I have less mods on Twitch, is... Uh, that's not a... Accurate comparison. I don't think it's that... Strange. Also, YouTube chat is less active than Twitch. It absolutely is. It's so weird to have coconuts and wafers. So overkill. I have just like... I will time that person out though. <laughs> it's like a link to a porn channel. I'm gonna make it 30 minutes this time and come back with a new name. <laughs> like, I think it's against YouTube TOS to have links like that in chat. And it's not a bot, it's just somebody with a really edgy name. I think Lana Rhodes is a talented young woman, fan of her work, but uh, maybe not. Maybe not in YouTube chat. Let's go kill a Krampus with a pop shot. Let's do this real quick here. Pop a war cry, eat a wafer. <laughs> all I heard was three shots. Yeah, that's all it took. Yeah, yeah. I was in the hood again. I was prepared to shoot more. I war cried for that. I did not. I mean, I knew it'd be quick. I didn't think. Uh, Breezy, you got any power cells left up? So, anyway, pop shot. Yeah, I got like four Strong more. weapon. Now that's an underpowered enemy. Krampuses are actually really low power level compared to how high they get in Frost Knight, but still satisfying. Still satisfying. I'm gonna spank hard after we're done. To be honest with you. Collect a blue glow. We are very well behaved. Yeah. That's the thing about stream chats, you know? When absolutely anybody can pop into your chat and just start talking, you know? Chat's super well behaved until one person changes that. That's all it takes. That's all it takes. Love the streams. Appreciate it. Welcome, by the way. Alright, if anybody watching this on the YouTube channel in the future likes all the stream interaction, you should check out the Twitch link down below. I do stream on YouTube as well, but Twitch is far and away the superior platform for viewing. So many more emotes, channel points are super fun. I have a lot more redeems on Twitch than on YouTube, because there's 
no way to really do that on YouTube without heavy use of bots. And then at that point, it's not really seamless anymore. I don't prefer stuff like that. But yeah, Twitch is just a better platform for viewing. I have tried both for many years and I have a clear favorite. All right, let's get the structure of a lobber shield started. I like going two tiles up like this. This is what I always do. So I, I make these little bridges like a catwalk like a villain's base, and I specifically do it out of metal because there's usually a recycling user, and I like that. And then I like to go a couple of tiles out just in metal because I like to connect traps to these builds and making them out of metal makes them super strong. Not this corner, this corner doesn't need it. And then I go brick. Some people just go straight br uh, wood for their lobber shields. That's fine. It, it works. I just... I find that brick is something you have in excess in the end game. Uh, every Frost Knight run I make, it's... I'm never low on brick. So... Yeah. Oh, that burner health is low. What do you mean? It's only below 25%. Yeah, right. Somebody should probably go in there and deal with that. I have more coconuts for anybody who needs them. We might be all set. I don't know though. I'm all good for it. It's like a mom talking to her grown up kids. Like, no mom, we're good. We don't... We don't need anything anymore. And she's like, okay. I'm sorry, but it'll be in the fridge if you want it. Never we'll keep the coconut safe. In case you change your mind. Oh man, I love getting blue glow from the enemy drops. Two of them this round. So he's sticking to the pain train. How's it working? For well, so far easy. What's your mag size on pain train? Uh, 52. 52. Yeah, so that's like barely using crack shot. It is worth it. A lot of people forget that. You know, like I focus so heavily on my channel on like the sustained fire of crack shot, but as long as you get up to 52, it's an average of like 145 divided by 2 at that point. I think it's uh all math is hard. 22 72.5% damage bonus kind of just doing more and more and more and more and more. You just got to make sure to get to that final bonus to take full advantage. That air horn for sure. Can we drop you the mats for the traps that you can just put whatever traps you want? You can. Um, I trust you to trap though if you want to do it. I am fine either way. If you want to help or not, you do whatever you want. I'm just uh, getting some supplies and kind of farming. And I'm running really low on metal though. Maybe I should yeah, stop. I'll give me some if you want. Yeah. I also have my recycling if you have more. What well, else are you? Oh, I've been taking your recycling. I've been stealing okay. it. Ventures reset January 24th. Timeline in the description, though, if you guys are watching this in the future and want the current season. Timeline in the description. Super, super useful resource. There's Blue Glow behind me. Okay. I, uh, I did some original testing when I first started running wafers in these runs to see, like, how many wafers I need and I was good with like 70 when I was running Zenith and popping wafers constantly so generally I shoot for like 50 then cuz if I didn't use 70 then I don't need 50 <laughs> or 50 should be enough 44 still 44 whatever beast you are big and strong what did I miss a comment that uh, Breeze, could you help me kill this mimic? I'm gonna bring it over. Who oh, really? said they were dropping metal? Is gotcha. that somewhere? Uh, um, it was me. I'm gonna bring metal. Oh, I can give you it now if you want. Yes, I have 13. More than 13 would be Thank sufficient. You, you had a thousand metal just kind of chilling. Do you need a uh, power cell? I've got 800 more. Like five. You have 800 yeah, more? That wasn't even all of it. Do you need anything while you need more tokens? I got no, no, I'm good. <laughs> I got, I got like 36. Sure. Oh. Please, how many coconuts do you have? 
All right, you gotta stop offering coconuts. <laughs> Ty, I want all your shotgun shells. Come here. You want my shotgun shells? Okay. I'm the only one running shotguns, oh, so I'm not gonna craft it. Oh wow, I am good now. Jeez. More metal. You guys are just sleeping on this. Alright, thank you. Alright, I'm dropping my materials. Alright, good. Hmm. This is an interesting defense. I haven't seen this layout in a little while. Well, let me go up here as well. I always like to supercharge, or supercharge, Jesus. Uh, upgrade all the metal surrounding the recycling. Just to get that cooking. Blue blow, very nice. Just got one to 10, how good is the pop shot? Right here I mean, the burner. Pop shot's a top three shotgun, so 10 out of 10, like. That's the thing about ranking weapons. It's fun for a video and it makes for an educational watch for newer players, but you know, just because I put a weapon higher or lower than another doesn't mean it's strictly better. Um, like pretty much every shotgun in the top seven, maybe it was like a 10 out of 10 shotgun. You know what I mean? Like they're all good. So pop shot, you'll see it, especially as we get to those later rounds. It is a very, very strong weapon. It'll show its might once we have something big we can actually shoot at. I mean, earlier, three-shotting a Krampus, super satisfying. Yeah, those were crits, but yeah, I'm running Toy Rocket out, so... Still counts. <laughs> Let me get some arches. I've seen this happen in other runs where we build a defense like this and then conveniently forget that all of our traps are connected to one build. It's good to do that. Also, if you guys have extra builds, it's always good to just kind of upgrade stuff as you run around. Best here to supercharge first. Uh, I'm going to link my supercharging video because that is a really good resource on how to spend them. Just got an ad for a $1,000 laser cutter. Oh my god. Well, for $5, you can subscribe on Twitch and get no ads whatsoever. So, there you go. You use your Twitch Prime subscription. You can sub for free with Twitch Prime. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I didn't think you saw it. What's the best way to mass farm quartz? Not passively. I don't know how to mass farm quartz, to be honest. Like, you can... Beeline for... I mean, honestly, all the things that you do passively, just focus on them. R literally, run around in a map, look at look through the caves, look through the quartz encampments, look through all of the quartz uh, anomalies, do storm chests, do... Um, target practice... Just focus on getting as many weapon drops as possible, because recycling quartz weapons is a really good source of quartz. Killing uh, glowing animals is really, really good. Like, there's not one tip. There's just, like, a bunch of different things that if you keep on top of, you'll get all the quartz you need. And that's all stuff I suggest doing passively. Like, everybody watching this, like, as you're playing throughout the game, just kill every glowing animal. Do storm chests, do target practice, uh, recycle stuff. If you're running coconuts, you're going to be searching a lot of containers passively and uh, recycling what you get from those containers is really big. Recycling is huge. Oh, it's so huge. You get so much stuff back. I'm asking because I'm adventure is not good enough and I can't get to a... Uh, and I can't go lower power level. Yeah. Oh, we got a flinger over here. You got him. Okay. Yeah, this is all stuff you should do throughout ventures, you know? I don't think you profit buying something from a vending machine and then recycling it, but... Everything else I mentioned is, is really good to just keep up with. Is that Donna? No, but Donna is back. Donna! Oh, I heard a sound that was like, faintly like Donna, and then... then she's here. Look at that, 385 metal. It's a- You sensed it. I did, I felt her presence. There's this distinct lack of comfort, and I thought, it's Donna, she's near. <laughs> lack of comfort. <laughs> hey, that's so rude. I know. <laughs> <laughs> he said, I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
I just felt gross, and I was like, Donna, she's near. Hey, Fallen, no Mr. on the Beast. You can get them from presents? Quartz? Or whatever they're talking about? Yeah, all these tips are really good, I think. Like, I, I really want to update my super old How to Get Every Item video. It's... It's not strictly outdated. There are good tips, but there's so much more I would say nowadays, and... just feel like there's a lot to know but as you can imagine everything I just mentioned is a lot to know there are so many little things you know oh it's super easy to get quartz just do target practice and storm chess and loot passively and kill the glowing animals and you know sacrifice your firstborn to our lord and savior the devil and blah 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 blah, blah. and then suddenly it becomes a lot it's a lot to keep up with as a new player and um it's just uh it's just a lot of stuff that if you make a habit out of it, you'll get plenty, you know. <laughs> Trap only Frost yeah. Knight? That'd be fun. No shooting whatsoever is, like, scary. I have one brick and one, uh, three metal. I got a thousand metal. Oh you. my god, you always hurt me when you say that. Wow. Just build. Just build around, you know, get that lobber shield out. It's getting pretty important at this point. I see a lot of upgrades on the lava shield. If you just extend it out and then upgrade, that'd probably be more effective right now. Two months? Two Artemis, months. thank you so much for the continued support. I think we're off cooldown for a hype train. I know Aura wanted hype train emotes earlier. Just saying, if anybody else has been cooking that resub, you know, now's a great time, maybe. I need a level four. Yeah, he needs a level four. I'm starting with level 1 aura. I'm not comfortable asking for a level 4 hype train out of nowhere. Whoa, the cup! Did the cup splash from that? There's kind of a lot of poggers in there. I I I was saying for my emails. I know. I... Where are where? But I gotta start people at a level 1 hype train so we can get to level 4 later, maybe. That's fair enough. Um... What challenges are you doing? We're just doing a holiday themed run. Not specifically a challenge, just having fun with holiday themed heroes and weapons. Modern Warfare 3 2011 before. Yeah, I got like 1400 hours in that game, something like that. I played a lot of that. I had every gun gold. It was kind of easy in that game. It was just like weapon level, so challenges and kills and you're basically guaranteed gold, but it was a lot of kills and challenges, all right? I was proud of that. What game are we talking about? Modern Warfare 3. The real Modern Warfare 3. Jake, thank you for the 100 bits. One off a hype train. You, uh, you good there, homie? No. Okay. Yes, I am now. They're dead. Oh, you guys I can see. see the power of the pop shot coming through. It's so hard to switch off between pop shot with a P-O-P -P and pot shot, which is different. It's kind of cool that they, they made them the same. Oh yeah, then you got the Storm King's Wrath and then the Wraith. I think those are the two most similar. There might be one more though. We got one more for a hype train. If anybody has 100 bits, any kind of prime sub or resub, now's a good time. If you guys want ad-free viewing, subscribing is a great way to do that. Breezy. <laughs> Breezy. Breezy has pushed a number of hype trains along, but I never expect anybody to do any- No, well, this time he does. I never expect anybody to do anything, even if they donated before. I just appreciate it all. I am so fucking angry. Too pro- That's totally fine! Donating is optional and highly appreciated. In that order. Uh, thank you so much, Breezy. Good to find the guys as well. Getting us to 56%. If we make it to level 2, then emotes will be able to get distributed. Oh, me, Dan. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Man. Uh, Breezy, come here. Can I have your carved twine, planks, and efficient parts? You can have one here. I'm assuming you have enough for your weapons as well, so don't go too broke for my sake, but... With all this, I can just spam planks. tire traps all day. Yes, planks. <laughs> okay, that was a bad time to burp because I almost peaked. Fucking good to find with the 10 gifted subs! Jeez. Thank you so much! 
to It's Wahoo. I think it's a fellow streamer. Uh, in at Inset Smile, uh, the Boon Blop, the Blue, the Boon Blop. Say that three times fast. The Blue, the B. The Boon Blop. I've been having a hard time. Like, the intro of this video, I screwed up so bad and just refused to re-record it. So everybody watching this on YouTube in the future knows I am having a tough day. And the Boon Blop. The Boon Blop just breaks my tongue. I can't. As a native English speaker, this is just hurting my whole, my soul. My whole soul. Uh, Sidhu, so need some fucking vowels. Thank you. Gifted sub to Desi, Ewari, Mystics, Guansina. That's fucking funny. Claudia, Save the World, and Arabella. There are some solid names in that. You made that up. That, you made the, that up. Guancina, it says it right there. Zero three. Oh, I know. Guancina. And his name is Guan Honestly, bad respect to whoever came up with Literally, that. Literally. That is funny. Yeah, in my brain was like a Mexican mariachi band. Da, 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 da. Oh, <laughs> Guancina. Without, even without the name, da, 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 da. it's just fucking funny. That's awesome. Someone needs to make a video of that. Oh, God. that's so funny. <laughs> I won't right, support. No, you won't dare. Aura with 100 bits. Canuck's games with 100 bits. There's the level 4 that Aura wanted. Thank you, Good Define. Thank you so much. You subbed with Prime? Did I miss that? I don't see the... Hold on. I believe you, but I don't see the notification. Maybe you need to share it before it goes through? I don't see an alert for that. I thank you regardless. I just don't think it came through. Um, offline yesterday. I don't know what that means. I was celebrating my two-month sub offline yesterday. Oh, you... You had a two month sub when I was not even live? You guys are crazy sometimes. People will do that. They'll like resell when I'm not even live. I thank you so much. I haven't been streaming yes. as much recently because, you know, Christmas, November was very, 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 very busy for me. I uploaded nearly daily. Did you guys know I posted 78 videos in December? Yeah, so it was a lot. And I've been chilling, you know? It's it's January, ad revenue shit, everybody's back to school anyway. I've just been relaxing a bit, catching my breath from a couple of months uh, going crazy, so. There have been less streams, and I, I appreciate you guys. All you the guys support. You can hold subs, right? So you can, what I do is if I get a notification that my crime sub is up, I'll just go sub to beast, and then Great I'll, choice. If you, click, if you click the three dots, um, it, you click the three dots next to the share button, you can pin, and then, and then it'll just sit there until you actually share it in the chat. And then the, the streamer same. the streamer right. won't get the notification until you press the share button. Yeah, and I it think that's what's happening here. It does the same thing for ours on our monthly anniversaries, so I do that a lot too. I mean, the streamer will still get the sub, but they won't get the notification that you subbed until you do right. the thing. Uh, who's in front of me? Everybody, uh, tie it right behind you. Drop your rough or all of it. All your rough or. I'm being so demanding in this game. Do I have? I do. I have 10. Oh, that's not a lot of... Okay, who has actual rough war? Breezy? Kieran? I've got 160. Yes, uh, yes, 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 yes. Perfect. Okay. Let me just go ahead and craft. I Tar can go pits, farm, floor farm, farm for rough. Sure. Four hype not strictly necessary, but uh, more rough war is good, so... So I'm just putting uh, tar pits all in this central area. As you guys know, smashers are a problem. Um, yes. This will be very, very, very helpful for the mini bosses that always kill me in every run. And I'll put floor freeze out here. Thank you guys so much for the hype train. We are at 56% of level four with one minute on the timer. So if anybody wants to push it further, you have one minute to do so. Or if you just want to get any of the hype train emotes and click off onto your second monitor while you're trying to place traps, you can do so as well. 50 seconds left on the timer, 100 bits minimum to get emotes, any kind of sub. Prime sub for free if you got it is uh, eligible. Prime. Thank you ads for the prime sub. Wait, what? <laughs> they're changing the prime subs? Wait, what do you mean, Dimension? Yeah, I don't know what they're changing about prime subs. Please I, elaborate. I've heard that it's not profitable for them, and I don't... I've never expected them to be permanent, but... Holy cow! Good to find! The cup on the right is not full, but it's gonna splash... It didn't! It just bonked! It bonked, everybody! Thank you so much, I really appreciate it. Super, super supportive, I, I really thank you. Bonk in my cup. The drum shotgun will save the world? We already have it. We already have a drum have shotgun. A Is it ricochet? Let me double check before I- Ooh. Can we come put slow go down? 
<laughs> Demon uh, gamer. Hold on. I'm, I'm just trying to kill a ricochet mini boss without killing myself. Dying. I'm just slowly eating coconuts. There we go. It's possible, everybody. You just got to be careful. Demon Gamer filling up the cup. Thank you. Thank you. Preventing the bonk. Cups should splash, not bonk. But there are people like good to find that are just so crazy with the bits. They'll just drop a thousand at once. And, oh, oh, okay, lagging, lagging, lagging. Goodness. There are people like good to find just crazy with the bit. Him and B Breezer. I was just... tell you that you were lagging in chat. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Figured I'd stop talking since Thanks, apparently I lag for real when that happens. But I haven't restarted my router since last time, so I'm just I'm just struggling with it. All right. Oh, what's the recycling? Okay, good. Yeah, you guys have been grabbing it. I just don't want it to be empty. Um. Yeah, level five. Wait, why? Oh, that pushed it along to zero percent. Level five, zero percent. We are exactly at level five right now. Thank you so much. Should probably. Text. I'm gonna run away. I'll see you guys later. Love you. Bye. 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 Oh, I shouldn't even have an excuse this time. Just leaving. Period. Yeah. I just had enough of you guys. Bye. <laughs> I am certain that's what I actually meant. <laughs> I've definitely annoyed her enough whenever I've been streaming because of the people that I've been hanging out with that she just needs to mute. Oh wow, you you uh, hang out with some real shitheads? Uh yeah, musician Tushi. Musician's uh, great. So is Tushi. Yeah, no, no. What? <laughs> that's what I've been hanging out with. <laughs> this is like a diss track <laughs> happening live. Just no, throwing just names saying, under the bus. Just, including myself, we all just talk very I'm loudly about people. stuff and uh it's gets to a point where especially if rosa's live she has to just leave the call or mute because it's too loud yeah xqc yeah the uh that could be very strong too, but i will absolutely throw other people under the bus too uh what am i doing I'm just kind of running around in circles yeah what tire traps are so strong that once you get them down they're, they're pretty good two minutes left on the hype train i we're at zero percent and good divine was was carrying that last wave so if anybody wants any emotes you can but uh i'm thinking the hype train is gonna call it here but you never know you know i always call it early and then some high roller just makes me look like a fool so there you go i think this is good but we got a couple minutes left there's time there's time to do some party hips what we find out more often than you think yeah. Is that why I posted so much during December? Yeah. So November and December was a crazy combination of uh, oh, hey. was a crazy combination of Fortnite OG bringing new players and it being the holiday season. Holiday season is always good. People are off of work. They're off of school. Uh, people are spending a lot of money during that time, so ad revenue for YouTubers goes up globally, basically, because advertisers are just blowing their budget in December. I made 33% of my YouTube revenue in the last two months for the year. A quarter of my yearly earnings came from November and December. Okay, Kieran's dead. Okay, um, just Art, down for the count. Part. And that was consistent with uh, Twitch as well. Die. You guys and your crazy donations. What? What? I heard Aura say die. No, I said don't die. Oh, we need our base down type. Oh? Well, here we go. We have an incomplete lava shield. Okay. Man, these flingers are just going for it. Okay. Okay. Okay, alright. No Did she get the base down? Yep, but she died trying. And that's the hype train. Thank you guys so much. Everybody enjoy your emotes. Or did you get a new emote? Yep, that's my last one for level four. Damn. So I believe all I need left is like one more level three mode and collection is complete for this side. Look at that affliction damage doing so well. <laughs> I 
should start eating wafers more. I don't know why I'm saving them. I eat one wafer and delete the mist monster in front of me. And not even gonna sink the moon. All right. Beach, you're not gonna like this. And then, what, party hips? Why would I not like that? Oh, hey, Logan. <laughs> Welcome back. Dawson, thank you for the sub, by the way. I appreciate it. Probably splashed the cup when I wasn't looking, focusing on not dying. Um, um, wait, hold on. I got a Well, the flag to see what team gets. I'm surprised they don't make flingers, lobbers, throw tomato heads. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if it helps them to be talking. Oh, 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 yeah. Planks and carved one. I need more planks. I have 34. If you guys want to run along the top and just upgrade the lobber shield, that'd be very good too. That does affect whether or not they throw them. We played Modern Warfare 2 2009. Yeah, it's probably the best gaming experience. Well, funny, that game is the best and worst gaming experience I've ever had. Thank you for the planks. Confirmation on the pickup. Like, Modern Warfare 2 created some of the angriest, most disgusting experiences I've ever had in gaming. All I have to do is say noob tubes, and it probably triggers like PTSD and gamers oh across the lands. Yeah. But the highest highs I've ever had in gaming came from that game as well. So I don't know how I feel about Modern Warfare 2. I don't know if that game was good for me or not. People always ask me about the target practices when I do them, and it's like, yeah, well, I grew up on FPS games, so that's that's how. But. When I find edgy content funny, it's like, well, yeah, I grew up on FPS games, so. <laughs> Tire traps are so strong. All right. Am I running a nature pop shot? You know, I'm not going to lie. I did not even double check my element. For those who don't know, Water has the least friction of any element in Frost Knight. There's one nature round and that's it. So I might have done a oopsie by crafting it this way. Do I have other pop shots powered up? Maybe somebody in our game does, but I don't think so. ABC, MLP, QRS. Okay, so it's above S and Q. It's under H. No, I don't think I have any other pop shots. All right. I just realized mine's nature, and that won't do well against future smashers, so... Um, I can craft you differently. Do you have a water or fire? Or energy, I guess? Yeah, I do. I just need to scroll down. Well, thank you. I always forget, wafers and rock and riff actually increases damage as well. Like, I only eat them if I feel like I should be critting. But there's a oh, lot yes, more. Oh yes, I craft them in every element. Which one did you want? Water. Water. Okay. Um. Do you have some efficient? <laughs> I'm low on efficient. I do. Right in front of you. Side so stab first, and you could be like, "Damn, I really hey, need a tech slicer right now." She'd be like, "Yeah, I got that supercharged." <laughs> Is that Alonzo in chat? <laughs> yeah, it's been great. I like waters? running Frost Knight. Just one or two? Just one. Just one. Okay, here you go. It's right. your perks on here too, by the way, so here we go. Right. It's my perks. That is not a pop shot. Oh, you mean the shotgun. I have that too. I'm sorry. You meant <laughs> the shotgun. I have that in every element too. But I'm sorry. I got... This is a holiday-themed run, Ty. Um, like P-O-P. -P, like urination, oh, urination. Pot shot is like weed shot, you know? Will someone do the burn? There you go. Oh. That's Beautiful the way to clarify. That's how we figure it out. It? What a be perfect. <laughs> are you talking about like like peeing or pot? Which what, what kind of shot are we looking for here? It always throws me between the two. I'm like, oh, you want the the launch here? I understand like, how in Frost Night you wouldn't blink hearing pot shot, but it's a holiday themed run. There's no none of that here. That's a spy weapon. Um, there's a much more blah blah blah. Yellow. Okay, I can do yellow. 
in theme of the pop shot. Man, Emerald hasn't replied to me today. I don't know what she's up to. She's gonna check her phone and see all these texts about the hype trains. I've texted her like four times. You guys have been crazy today. That's her thing. She likes hype trains. She'll join if she can, but... She is a mom of six with a healthy family, so, you know, I don't blame her when she's <laughs> away from the computer. Six. Yes. I... Not a... Definitely ask her about it next time she's around. She'll <laughs> tell you all about it. Hmm. Santa's little helper included here. Yeah, I haven't crafted one myself, but Ty's been using it. I don't, you know, funny, typically you'd use a- oh, ah, 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 Thousand ping again! Funny, typically you'd use a Santa's Little Helper as a high damage weapon, but I'm running a toy rocking out shotgun build with one of the best shotguns in the game, so I'm fine on that front. This is like when I did the Mythic Only run, I, I carried the Wrath as my quote-unquote damaging weapon, but I was running the Scourge with Crack Shot, I wasn't exactly short on damage in that department. Mini boss. All right. I'm not scared of mini bosses in this run. Oh, they are targeting me, even though I'm up here. What do we got here? Shield breaker acid pools. Holy crap! Man, I got a leg spike. I think. Okay, ricochet hurts. What a surprise! Right. Uh, Breezy, did you want, um, a shotgun? The pot shot, pot shot? Pot I'm, like, shot. staring uh, at my health no, while no, shooting no. the ricochet smasher. We'll talk. I'm, like, regulating my damage. Ah! Back off! Oh my god. Oh, he's Normally okay. Normally, you want people on top of him. Ouch. I have, like, no healing, so... There we go. Okay. Well, now I need coconuts. Ty? <laughs> hmm? Ty, you still got coconuts? You were the distributor earlier. I do. I have shit time. I have, I have eight. Come on. Uh, I have zero. Oh. You need some? Ty, how many do you got? 30. Here you go. I'll just take whatever that is and... Here. I have 60 now! Okay. That's plenty. If anybody needs more, you let me know. She got, dropped me way too many. Ooh, nice anti-air traps on that. Well, that was fun! You went full chicken there for a second. Yeah, it was scary times. <laughs> scary times calls for desperate clucking measures. Somebody's laughing somewhere, probably. Here, did you uh, want a shotgun? Or did you have your weapon already set? I've got a pop star already. What? Oh. Okay. <laughs> well I don't know. That was the most British sentence I've heard today. So I heard. Oh, okay. I've got one already. That's what I said. I reminds me when I was vacationing with a British friend of mine, and him, his girlfriend, and her sister, and it was like the amount of times I just stared at them blankly and was like, "What? What's just?" Uh, it was my fault, but not always. <laughs> Sometimes I'm like, slow down, less British. Try that again for me. Help me. I'm American. You understand? Less British. That's what I tell him. I mean, he reacts the way Ty does. Just thinks it's funny. <laughs> I'm not as British as I used to be. Did you used to be British? I, I was making a joke oh, 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 on oh, oh. how America is split off in Britain. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, we kind of went a different way. Ah, run away! Is that a war cry? I'm getting right into it. Oh. Boombo. 
And yes. propanes that I try not to blow up. Are you blowing up the traps I just put down? Sure are. Okay. Oh, whoops. Yeah. Just destroy all this hard work like that. How could you? Being British myself, we just think most Americans don't understand this period. You know, it's... Not a, yeah. Recently got the pot checkers used the best decision? Yeah, it's a great weapon. It's a great weapon. I don't have a wrath. Should I use a discharge or a pot shot on mini bosses? Yes. So, the discharger is the best weapon in the game for smashers. That includes smasher mini bosses. The exception to this rule is non smashers. The plasmatic discharger is. Okay, yeah, nice casual 300 ping. God, that just keeps happening every wave, man. Yeah, you're lagging again. Maybe I should restart my route. It's getting ridiculous. <sighs> anyway. It's like you like on Discord before you lag again. Mm hmm. Anyway, um, the plasmatic discharger is the best versus smashers, but non smashers, it's actually quite weak. Surprising how much of that matters. So the discharger becomes secondary to the pot shot when you're versus regular enemies. And the pot shot is excellent because it can be any element, which gives it that el elemental bonus, you know. The discharger is energy only, so it's going to do reduced damage versus elemental targets. So if you're going up against a fire mini boss, you're now doing 75% 70 of your damage instead of 100% of your damage. Just a 25% cut right off the top. Whereas the the pot shot, the like the weed shot, you can use any element that's fitting to the situation, including physical, which physical versus a physical is doing 24% more damage. It's significant. So anyway, yeah, pot shot, good weapon. You plan on running all of them with double, with reload double mag size? That's not recommended. It's so boring to recommend a crit build on the pot shot. I know. Nobody likes fishing for crits, but you kind of have to. If you're running triple damage, it'll work, but it won't. It won't necessarily kill faster, I believe. Like, does a triple damage pot shot magically one hit blasters and takers? I don't think it does. If it's funny, that's fine. You do whatever you want, but. I just don't want anybody running that thinking that's ideal. If you're having a good time knowing what you're doing, don't let me stop you, but. In a broadcast with lots of people watching, I just don't want anybody to get the wrong idea. It hits 7.5 times slower to non-smashers. Is that what's happening? I mean, I know that's accurate, but is it bug to shoot more versus smashers or bug to shoot less versus non-smashers? Because if the damage that the Discharger does versus smashers, if that's its normal amount of damage, then this weapon is more broken than we already knew it was. Because you shoot the Discharger versus a non-smasher, and it just kind of zaps occasionally. Good damage, but honestly unremarkable, I guess. But versus the Smashers, it goes from like zap, 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 zap to a Smasher or the Storm King, where it's like zap, 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 zap and it's dead. Made him, yeah, 0.2 seconds versus 1.5 seconds. I'm sure my zaps were extremely accurate, I'm sure. I don't know. <laughs> somebody said, hi, Dad. And it reminds me of that joke where somebody was like, I had a, I got a vasectomy because I didn't want kids anymore. And when I got home, they were still there. <laughs> and I think it's really funny. <laughs> I think I'm light on traps over here. Okay. See, sometimes I place traps in the early game, and then in my mind that box is checked, even though it's five, six, seven rounds later, and it's time to put more traps there. Because, you know, early on you just put whatever traps you can afford and move on. Now I can afford more. Those wall darts should actually hit those enemies up there. The leg spikes, that could be tires bouncing. No. 
because I have spammed tire traps a lot in my day, and they never spiked my ping to 1,000, so... This is a new problem. This is a new problem. Well, this is a pretty smooth run so far. Any concerns? Knock on wood. We don't need to knock on wood. I'm certain this run will be perfectly fine. I have no doubt. All right. I always like saying that because there are uh, superstitious people out there and they hate it when I talk like that. <laughs> I'm not superstitious. A little stitious, but... <sighs> Hero of the Man, welcome! Is it worth supercharging Flash AC for the Blackout Boom build? Um, yeah, actually. Supercharging the hero gives hero ability damage. Oh my god. More ping. Supercharging the hero gives you extra hero ability damage, which is very impactful in that build. So, supercharging Flash AC, I think, is significant. I'm not sure, though. Potshot have triple damage and damage to bosses? I don't know. Don't split the pole. I don't know what that means. Probably some sex thing. It's a first-time chatter, so it's probably just a troll post. You watch my videos? That's awesome! I think everybody should do that. You know, it's funny. You know, chat was a little too busy earlier when we were running Frost Knight and I couldn't keep up with everything. And now the game is settled down, the traps are in, our setup is good, we got our weapons, we're chilling, and I think I put my chat to sleep. That happens with Frost Knight, it gets so casual. So relaxed. Half the Discord call is muted. We got like seven of us in here. Six. That's why I'm here. No, seven. It is seven. What? Yep. That's oh, somebody yelling in the background. Wow. Here, I got excited <laughs> for a thinking for a second, thinking, wow. We got some chatter, and then. Yeah. There's a lot going on where I'm Oh, it's a superstitious saying, splitting the pole. Yeah, I, I haven't heard that one, sorry. When I don't understand what somebody's saying on stream, it's... If it's talking about a pole, it's just way too likely that it's... ...not related to what I was talking about, but... No, I've never heard that. Neither had I. I feel like superstitions have taken a turn, although... People still believe in horoscopes, unironically. Astrology, that's, uh... Yeah. When I was dating... I guess I am still technically dating, but I've been focusing all of my dating efforts on one woman for a while now, and I continue... I, I plan to continue that. So when I was actively seeking people to date, it was quite a common thing. Women my age, in the young 20s, who, like... Like, it's not a joke or a cute thing. Some of them genuinely believe in astrology. Like, they'll swipe left if your sign is important, in a way. I, it's shocking. That in 2023 at the time, two at the time, um, people still believe in that. But yeah, that's, uh, that's how that goes. I need to sort by rating. I didn't know- I did not know you could sort your inventory, by the way. That standout knowing Ray is an ex- yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Ray in this game? I muted her a long time ago. We got Smashers, Breezy. You're up! Frozen on the west right. side, coming in on the north. Then we got another one, Frozen on the east side. You look like you're doing fine. This man's just walking around in circles. Wasting my adrenaline rush and a misclick. I love that. Two and a half minute cooldown, three minute cooldown, just because I clicked the wrong button. Didn't even click it, I rolled my thumb. Or my, my middle finger, whatever I use. Sad. That's racism with extra steps? Oh, I don't know about that. I think horoscope is more focused on your birth rather than your race, but... It is still... Judging somebody by something they can't control. Like, wait, so because I was born in June, I'm now ineligible to be your boyfriend? That's fucking weird. That's weird. That's fucking weird. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Oh. Oh, mom just texted me sloppy joes and broccoli. 
I'm sitting here growing more and more hungry. And she's just been up there taking care of that. That's a quality mom right there. Best mom I've ever had. When they're frozen, I can't tell if they're fire. I have to, like, pay attention to the effects. I know I'm taking damage. Okay. Mm. With max offense, basically all the bonuses. With a pot shot with affliction. You would need to... You need links to one shot a blaster without a double crit. Just doesn't hit hard enough. So that's kind of my point. What he's bringing that in up is because... Uh, what, what I was saying earlier with triple damage pot shots. Even if you run triple damage, you're not one-shotting a blaster suddenly. You're still going to take two, maybe three hits to kill a blaster, which is pretty much what a crit copy would have taken anyway. And smashers especially, like... Without crazy setup, AS-407, with like a normal build... Now let me just refresh this, because I'm asking him a question, and my ping is too high! Uh, AS, what about like, uh, a smasher, power level 250? Like... If you don't... Oh my god, this... Oh, that... Never mind, I didn't have a Warcry available. Okay, I thought I was lagging. How much would a normal pot shot? No team bonuses, because most people aren't running anything that buff a pot shot. They're just running a normal build, and then the pot shot's just kind of happening in the background. You just pull it out for that one time. What would a normal pot shot take to kill a Smasher? Because I, I bet it's more than three shots. So if you're not killing a Smasher in less bullets with a triple damage pot shot, then... Whether or not you knew it, you were already spamming the pot shot and therefore already fishing for crits. See what I mean? The difference with a crit build is it takes the same number of shots on average, but you have the chance to crit, kill him in one hit, and it's a lot more effective. I wanted to kill that smash before the round ended. Best person with pop shot? There you go. Thank you for the command in YouTube. To be fair, it's a good way to dodge a bullet if a girl is going to judge you on your horoscope. That's true. That's true. I used to do that when I was swiping on the apps. If, uh, if somebody put a little too much importance on horoscope, I would just avoid that. Uh, yeah. I've seen, like, memes online where somebody's like, Hey, the day went really great, I had a fun time, but I just realized that your horoscope is whatever whatever, so I'm not gonna be able to see you anymore. And he's like, oh. Can you Venmo me for oh. the bill then? <laughs> <laughs> Like, can you pay for your drinks then? If that wasn't a real date. You know, if a if a birthday was going to disqualify me the whole time, we could have skipped the dating part. Wasting an evening with a girl who's not going to call you back because of a birthday. Anyway. Funny stuff has arisen from such a stereotype. Not a stereotype, but a... Superstition. There we go. Which I guess is a stereotype with a fancy name. Is it a stereotype? Like, how do they decide that? Are people born throughout the year, like, traditionally certain attitudes? And I don't think it's so. It's the mindset, whether it's yeah, accurate. That's the thing with me. People are always surprised on my side. People are always surprised on your side? I'm actually nice. I'm like, are you supposed to not be nice? That's the thing, though. Exactly. That's yeah, so like, are there certain. I guess people just assume that Scorpios are just mean to everybody. Right. It's just not me. So for like one, what is it, month of the year, are we just pumping out a bunch of mean babies? Is that how that works? Like, that's so silly. Yeah. <laughs> that's so I silly. Just I uh, just horoscopes and astrology and people using that to judge people. I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't care so much if it wasn't like a real thing that I see. Yeah. Like, it's easy to write it off as a silly thing nobody cares about, but they do! I was sharing stories about people who, like, uh, got ghosted by a girl because of their birthday. <laughs> like, what? The date went well and you liked me, but my birthday discontinued further discussion. Okay. Speaking of dating, I made a terrible financial decision recently. Oh, no. You, you supported the Cradle Kickstarter with way more money than you should have. <laughs> Uh, no, I am planning to support it. With you money, should! But... Cradle Animation, everybody! I need to plug their Kickstarter. The Cradle book series is getting animated for the four of you who no, have any idea what I'm talking about. What was I your will, decision? I will pledge my money in wow. Uh, I got one month of 
hinges, hinges. Oh, price. hinge premium. It's no, it's like hinge X, and I got it for one month, and it's like fifty bucks. Fifty? I'm already regretting my decision. You see that Tinder added a subscription tier where like you can bypass all boundaries for like two hundred bucks a month. That's creepy as shit. I thought it was five hundred. That's even worse. If it's more expensive. <laughs> But yeah, I am already regretting my decision. Wait, what? Maple said, hands up 10 seconds, I oh. pick, I redeem. Wait, what? Oh, he said stream loots pack. Yeah, no, it's a pack, not cards. You can't just cheer 5,000 po or send 5,000 points and then pick a stream loots card. I have to send you a pack and then you'll see what cards you get then. I'll catch up on channel points after this round, how about? What are we on? 15? I'm getting pretty close to Smashers. Not next wave, but- ah! It is remarkable that I have done anything in this game uh, lagging as much. Rubber band. If you guys have trap materials, you should craft them and spam traps. We got the important ones down. If you guys want to just spam tire traps wherever it makes sense, wall darts, uh, move the floor freeze out, seal electric field, whatever you want to do. Just make sure you don't have an inventory full of unused materials. With all normal crit hits and a normal take at least three shots to kill, whereas previous will only would take four shots to kill. Two crit damage can easily one shot a 250 blaster, three damage can't. Okay. So maybe triple damage pot shot isn't as bad as I thought, but <sighs> it's just still good. Especially versus a mini boss. If you're not critting, you might as well not be shooting it. All right. So, we did the party hips, we did the party hips, I made the yellow light color, did the party hips. Maples, do you want a normal pack or do you just want your points back? Okay, go to J plays, go to gift packs, type in JPA, J hitting print screen instead of backspace, there we go, three cards, normal. Mm -hmm. He said normal, so we'll do Maples. Maples Biggest Beach is just the weirdest name ever and I want you to know it. Okay, send. Make sure you actually got that pack. I'm I'm assuming Maple's biggest beach is you. <laughs> but on the one in a million that there's somebody else with a similar name. Boombox said, yeah, these are subwafers. When I eat them, they activate rock and riff, which increases my damage by 50%, and it activates totally rocking out, which increases my crit rating by a lot. So Speaking of Boombox. The woofer doesn't work. It just doesn't work. Like it does no damage right now? All right. It fires blank shots. Very cool. Blue globe. I missed. How did I miss? Probably just hold on once. Look out! <laughs> Breeze is the only one with blue globe. Well, I guess I'll just not die then, I suppose. No smashers yet, but soon. If you had the ability to add things to save the world, what would it be? Well, I don't, so I don't usually talk about save the world stuff like that. Uh, the name of those seasons where there are more rewards, Legendary Survivor V-Box. Did somebody tell him? Mini boss. Nobody answered that question. Auntie Eris comes in a chat, first time chatter, asks a question, and everybody ignores him. Chat, you guys know the answer to that question. I need your help. I need your help. Oh, that's a water pain train. A water pain train. Is that nature and I'm blind? Because it looks like what? Oh, I fucking knew it! He survives with one HP and kills me! I should just run upstairs and grab some food since I'm dead. Oh, I'm gonna. That sounds great. I'll be right back. Okay, I guess I'm in charge of chat then. I'll be right back! Hi, chat. How we all doing? Hey, uh I need a channel uh, for making chicken noises. Uh, I think I'm good. How is Chef? Are we enjoying the stream? Yeah. Is the, is the broadcast satisfactory? Yeah. I hope it is. I, I do, yeah. Hi, Aura, and everyone else. Thanks. <laughs> 
Hello, demon gamer. It's demon gamer. Hi, Maples. How we all doing? Hmm. I didn't even see what? how died. I'm assuming it was yeah. Ricochet. No, we're not a mini boss we want there. Monotony of sorting, of sorting so many numbers is getting to me. Yes, yeah, so you know you can, like, take a break, right? Also, where do they die? You had all the blue left. Um, uh, that's a good question. Outside? Uh, I don't know. Outside question mark? Oh, probably over here. Well. It's either, it, I don't remember which side, I, I, I don't remember what it was like. 18 on me. So you have like, like 18 blue whales or something. Yeah, I got it. Okay. We're gonna do the game right at the south side. Yeah, we're right now. That he's gaming, he, he's shooting the blasters. He's, he's defending. He's defending the objective. Ah, uh, that one die. Oh, both Ty and Heath are dead. Wait, when did Ty die? Uh, that's a good question. Ty, how did you die? Uh, like 10 seconds ago. This me, Ty boss wave. 17 again. Okay. Well, I'm alive, so that's a good sign. Although it's mini boss around next wave, so I'm not sure. The monotony of sorting so many numbers is getting to me. Yeah, AS, you do a lot of math. Are you sure that's healthy? Turns out, turns out when you do a lot of something, it can become Water grave is best not for grave boring. Arm. And Nailer Beast 144 weapon. Don't die. No. Water grave is best. Ugh. 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 I hate all of that. Looking forward to the chromes. Why do people ask me that? I am not somebody who's ever had a major issue with chrome husks. I think they're funny because they don't despawn and they take up the spawn cap. Yeah, and they don't hurt the objective. So you actually ignore them and you can stall out an entire round. I don't generally... Well, they're not that overpowered anymore. They used to be, but they made it where they don't have as much of an impact on the spawn cap as they used to. And also the hus, you know, they despawn now. So, you know, they, they, they are, you can't just completely stall on a mission anymore with them, but you, you can get pretty close. It used to be so easy, too. Breezy, you got shotgun ammo, Kieran, too? Uh, I got pop ammo. Um, I guess. Thank you. Some. Chrome host, come All back. Alright. In, like... A fire... Paper? And smoke screen. Shit, okay. Oh, no. Well, I'm useless versus smoke screen. Oh, okay. Just hit me with a... Full brunt of a smash, or why not? Oh my god. No one off. Ah! Why is the grave digger so... Why do people care about so much? So back back in the day, back in the day with old State of the World, uh, I'm saying like 2018, uh, it was the same situation with like Skull Trooper. People didn't, for some reason, people didn't think the Great Figure was gonna come back. I don't know why they did, but they people thought it was never gonna come back. So people put it up on this pedestal of like a rare weapon or whatever. Um, and, you know, Stonewood kids still think it is, like, a rare special weapon, just like the jack o -Lantra Yeah, they still do. It comes back every year, and people 
hail it like it's way better than it is. Like, it's a great weapon, and I, I say that, but it's also not, like, lose your mind exciting. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a good weapon. I like it. Like, it is... I don't know why they... They do the same thing with the Jacko Launcher, and I think they do it with some other weapons. Well, Nocturno, I guess, because, you know, it's... You know, I can't get that weapon. But, uh... Like, the, I don't... I don't, I don't understand. I actually feel really safe in here, because of all the tar pits. But yeah, the Grave Digger is kind of like a mediocre weapon. I have way different opinions on it than Beast does, because I don't like the weapon, but, you know. Well, I ran it. Oh, fuck! If I saw the smoke screen, I just bailed. I ran it, it was really strong. Yeah, I figured that would happen. I was mostly just stalling him out. Although it's an eliminated enemies quest, I should not have been playing so silly. <sighs> oh, Kieran, look at above you. Look, all the traps are missing. Oh, he didn't look above him. Look all that shit on the side there. If you just ignore him, maybe put tar pits down, should be fine. Oh, I don't even know if you can hear me because I'm lagging again, 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 again. We can hear you. You're just, <sighs> you, your words aren't being missed. It's, weird. it's just your words are being dragged out. Strange. Well, if you just stay alive, uh, Kieran and Breezy, put tar pits down, stall out the smashers. Yeah. I also, I went upstairs to get food, and apparently I was too early. Oh! Oh, Ty's dead, so whatever. Ty, you here? Kieran, you're running Chaos Agent. What do you want? Oh, yeah, because you're running... Yeah. Yeah, you have to reload. Okay, yeah. I feel like that's not synergistic with crack shot, but you do eventually have to reload. Like you, support, to you should run. You what? Didn't know what else to put like my assault. Hmm. Like assault ammo recovery or light show Spitfire would have been great for shooting longer. Which you should take advantage of. Your crack shot. You keep reloading so soon. There we go. Uh, okay. I keep forgetting I am packed up. You what? I don't run him too often now. You don't run him too often. I don't. Well, I, I should have. I used him so much a while ago, but I kind of got a bit boring. Got a bit boring. How do you get bored with crack shot? Crack shot's great. The same way people get bored of Farah. It's just you, you destroy everything, and there's like no challenge. Archer, I'm obviously kidding. Ah. I'm a crack shot fanboy, so I have to be blindly supportive of crack shot at all times. I don't like dying versus mini bosses. It happens so much, and I just get so killed every to time. Answer, to answer your question, Dark Star, about pain train or grave digger for general use, it would be the pain train. Um, I disagree. It, They're very it, similar weapons. Well, the pain train just—I'm pretty sure that I'm pretty sure on paper it just flat out outdoes the damage of the grave digger. Maybe, but it's uh, very inaccurate, so you're not going to be hitting all those shots. And if you want to play into the joke, the grave digger is fire only. That's true. Pain. That's true. Pain train actually has elemental options. Those weapons are too close to compare. Archer will give you a straight answer. I won't. They're so similar. Also, Pain Train is a colder weapon because it makes train noises and it goes choo-choo when you reload it. That is an objective fact, so can't argue that. <laughs> Thanks, Archer. My favorite part of the weapon. Okay. Well... This looks like a pretty casual wave. Yeah, after the mini boss, it's like, oh, I just kind of hang out. I ran upstairs to get food, and mom texted me 20 minutes early. Marv is looking to run Frost Knight if anybody in chat needs a partner. He's gaming. Can you play Save the World? Maybe. Uh, if there's time later in the stream. If there's time. Uh, right now, we're just going to be playing Save the World, so hopefully that's fine. Yeah, this is one of those new three game modes that Epic launched. I love the fact that there is no damage drop-off on Affliction. 
So if anybody's wondering why I tag enemies with my shotgun from a distance where I would never kill them, it's because of that. And affliction crits, so I'm doing meaningful damage when it crits. You guys saw it earlier, it crit for 200,000 damage. 200,000 damage, just for free. So strong. I'm an affliction fanboy. I honestly think it is the strongest six perk. It's the strongest normal six perk in the game. There are examples of weapons that have special perks, like the Nocturno, that I'm pretty sure are better than Affliction, but even the Nocturno, honestly, I don't know. <laughs> um, that explosion's a little annoying because it only stacks when you reload, AKA stop firing completely, or when you kill an enemy, in which case they're already dead and they don't need you to do any more damage. So it's a weird six perk. Great for crowd clearing, but weird. I've calculated the Nocturno as like, effectively having a 65% damage bonus, but that's not even accurate. I mean, it's it's good if you want to just compare, but that's not strictly always true. That's just an optimistic number. But yeah, it's just, uh... It's just really, really good. Affliction does notable damage for free. I feel like Affliction adds crowd clearing to weapons that are high fire rate. I show it all the time where you can... What happened? Look at, look at Fortnite VIP. Mm, is this gonna kill me? Let me get to an area where I'm not gonna get targeted by an enemy. Oh, this better be worth musician. it. Holy shit! Holy Make me cow pause. Musician. Oh, yeah, he's at nine hundred thousand channel points on the stream. That's good stuff right Jeez. there. I think he said he was gonna build up That's to a so million and then buy stream loot with it. Oh, I believe it. Yeah, that's what I told you I was gonna do. Beast, I have another shotgun for you. Why? Well, it's just not about the break. Uh, uh, no. The one you dropped me is fine. Oh. Thank you, though. If you have it, I'll take it. I mean, if yeah, it's already right, crafted, I might as well just have that on me. Here you go. What oh, elements? Okay. Like one, yeah, water and nature is sufficient elemental coverage. I'll do a third less damage in the one single round where there are nature enemies. That's fine. You've been watching my YouTube for a long time. I appreciate it. Got plenty of more videos coming out. Here's your nature. Crafting. I already have a 144 nature. Yeah, Ty, get that 130 out of here. Wow. Trying so much to help me. First, she's offering me coconuts, then weapons. Who is this person? Helpful oh, teammate. I need coconuts. There aren't helpful teammates, just so awkward. Ugh. I'm good. Yeah, we're all good. I still have 47. Here. It's a prime number, by the way. I think I'm only eight in like, I don't know, like six. Do I have an AFK to an endurance build? Nope. I don't AFK endurance. You're, you're, you're more the game than endurance chat. Oh, he doesn't even he doesn't even run endurance. Beast has probably only ever ran twine endurance like, well, and beat it like once. Yeah, I beat it and was like, well, that chapter's closed. It was I don't even think he's. <laughs> I don't even think he's attempted any of the other zones. I've done them. I got them all in done. In your own storm shield or in other people. Yes. Okay. Give and take. I think I joined you once in a Candy Endurance, grabbed the rewards, and that counted. So I was like, oh, okay, I guess I'm done with Candy now. You might have you might have got it from my Stonewood one time, too. I, don't I know. definitely did Stonewood on my own. Plankerton, I think, was the same thing. I'm, I joined somebody late or whatever. It got done. That's all that matters. It, it did get done, and I don't know or care how. Oh, I'm so hungry now. See, I, I got extra hungry because I thought I was going to get food. So then my stomach was open to the idea. And then I'm not. So. Yeah. I'm struggling. Should just be my water. Mom, raiders, my mom's making chicken alfredo, but uh, oh, I don't like chicken that. alfredo. You should like so. it. Try liking it. I was like, I was like, oh, I'll just, I'll just make something in the air fryer. She's like, no, it's okay. I'll make you chicken and rice. I'm like, okay. Ooh. Wow. What kind of chicken rice? Chick fry rye or chick chi fry rye? Uh, 
just white rice and I don't know what kind of she does she puts some I think it's like it's not teriyaki sauce it's something that she puts in that chicken it tastes mm. good so Terry why Uh, Archer doesn't like chicken alfredo. What? Yeah, I, everybody likes chicken alfredo. You can't not like chicken alfredo. That's not in the rules. I don't know. I'm just I not a fan of like that kind of food. I've never like pasta and like uh, whatever ravioli. I'm just not a fan of. Where it. is the formioli? <laughs> Nothing. It's just cold silence. <laughs> Good I didn't God! Hear what you said. Oh no, I got that. The worst podcast ever. This is fucking crazy. SpongeBob reference out of nowhere. Dead silence. All right. Yeah, we just. I just finished off chicken alfredo yesterday. I'm not even a pasta eater. I just like chicken alfredo. Oh, I did not see that secret. <laughs> oh, that's how I go every day, every game. Oh, I'm dead. Yep. Yeah, always just one taker decides. It's like a predator missile. Yeah, we're fine. It's amazing watching the pot uh pop shot do lower damage in these end games. Normally enemies are so easy to kill with this thing, but look at that tire trap just pushing everything back. That's one of the main reasons we run tire traps. You just don't need to kill the enemies every time. Green light. I got you. I got you. Yeah, over here too. Tire traps. So that's the thing. You know, it's really awkward sometimes to talk about how good the tire trap is and then watch it do very little damage. But it's because it's pushing enemies back over and over and over. And you get tons of time to kill them because of that. It's a very, very effective way to play. Like I said earlier, I don't really support stalling tactics, but when it's built into the trap, I mean, gosh. It's hard to not use it. A redeem for chicken noises? I don't know what you're talking about. No idea what chicken noises means. How can I block this guy? Yeah, some people on the stream chat can be a little low. Uh... You know, on my YouTube chat, I had to like step it up. I used to have anybody could chat. That was a mistake on a YouTube stream. So then I had like 20 minute subscribers on YouTube, which is strict. I know if I went to Twitch and it was like 20 minute followers only, I would not like that. But I got some real knuckleheads in my YouTube chats. It was necessary. But then I went to like 10 minutes and then five minutes and then I think back up to 10 minutes. <laughs> five minutes was how long some knuckleheads were willing to wait and I, I didn't need that. The, tr the tough thing about YouTube is that it attracts so many viewers that were not planning on watching a stream today that they will throw their accounts away typing stuff that's a little dumb, a little smooth brain. Twitch is usually a bit better. People typically go to a Twitch stream planning on watching the stream. <laughs> so, get some more level-headed people. Uh, everybody drop me all your planks. Okay. Ty, 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 drop your planks, Ty. Gotcha. Right behind you, stop running, where are you going? Ty, where are you going? Yeah. I think you're muted. Okay, quick, 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 quick. 14, that's not that much. Kieran, where them planks at? You run away from me? Okay. Alright. Alright. I'm just gonna race out here and just replace as many tire traps as I can. Just replace all the meaningful ones. I know it's directional, I just don't care about that one. Okay, and then I'm gonna go out to this- Ah! Why did that cancel? 
<sighs> Go to this east side. I think that's fine. All right. Then over here. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. There we go. Okay. Last wave. Okay. There are smashes behind me. Ah, run away! Oh my goodness. Based on the trail, I think that smasher barely missed me. Alright, we got Acid Pool's Vortex, we got Wall Weakening Shielded, Damage Pulse Building Block. Okay, we got some very manageable mist, mist monsters here. Mini bosses, whatever. It's all kind of the same thing, isn't it? Very nicely done. Too close. Crap. That's a vortex mini boss. Yeah, staying around all the tar pits is gonna be really useful for staying alive. I don't even know what killed me. Isn't that just the best? Oh, this ping! <laughs> if it wouldn't end the stream, oh man, I would love to just restart my router. Okay. The mini bosses are dead. Let's go sprinting, uh, Trek. You what? Somebody's asking how do you sprint? Oh. Like you were doing. Shift. Okay. I hit shift. Also, have it it might not be bound by default. Yeah. I had to rebind my own. Wait, it isn't bound by default? No, it should be, but sometimes it isn't. Like, if you... If, like, if you... I think it, it's, like, some weird time period where if you, like, play the game, you, you buy and got changed or something. I don't remember. Hmm. So, considering shop reset, at the time of recording this video, <laughs> the shop reset is coming up soon. It might even be worth it for me to run upstairs, restart the router, modem, knowingly kill the stream, but then the stream would come back online and then I'd hop on, eat, daily video, whatever. Because this is actually a good time to maybe do that. Because this whole, it's a lot. Like, this is not unplayable by any means, but it's... It's spiking every wave, which is to say, like, every five minutes. Like, this is so bad. I don't know. I think that might be good. Are you liking the item shop skins lately, bees? Of course not. It's just been, like, nothing. <laughs> there haven't been item shop skins to speak of other than a couple of new ones. A couple of new ones. We're so spoiled, I know, but still. Yep, it wasn't bound. Holy moly. Yeah, and I don't blame you for not knowing, because... Tactical Sprint was... fairly recent. If you've been playing for years, you wouldn't have any reason to randomly go into your settings and check for that, so... I always hate that when I'm about to eat a wafer, and then... Battle Beat activates Slay Rockin' Out. Why is this chick invincible? Oh my god. You're a boomer player. Yeah, I don't blame you. Is Final Frost the last mod? Yes, it is. Hence the name. Final Frost doesn't leave uh, tonight, by the way. You still have a week. What's the one in there? The Witcher skins. Oh my gosh. The Baron feels slower with the movement. It's just... No, it's not slower. Yeah, I don't I don't remember what weird update time All period right. you had to be playing the game for your vines to get messed up. We did it! Right. We did a holiday themed Frost Night run due to popular what request. The... Super difficult Great as well. Job. Oh yeah, oh that was God, crazy hard. I think it's funny so that hard. 
Zenith, Ice King, and Crackshot are three heroes we use in Frostlight all the time anyway. <laughs> Kieran, weren't you We're running Crackshot? Yes, yes, I was. What's that combat? Oh, I guess I put traps down, but still. That emo mm -hmm. makes me think of a penis. Okay, well, I'm glad. Excuse me. Oh. <laughs> oh, so great notes for the video on. Yeah, glad to hear it, Ty. It's my emo. Thanks, Ty. Yeah. <laughs> Always appreciate it. Alright, thanks for watching on YouTube. Frost Knight playlist is in the description if you guys want to see more. Let's check out these rewards. I always like to see that part. Nearly 900 gold, couple of llamas. Good to see it. Alright. Kind of oh my god, Tom. Okay, okay, okay. Goodbye, what? viewer! <laughs>